Hi guys, my name is Rachel, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about names that I love but won't be using. And I'll also have the meaning and where the um, name come, came from as well uh, for the people that like that kind of So the first name that I just think sounds really, really pretty is Mia. And it's an Italian name and it means a wish for a child. So yeah, I just think that name is really, really pretty. The next is Isabella, which is a Hebrew name, and that means devoted to God. So if anybody has, like, you know, a uh, close relationship with God and everything like that and would like to use their faith or religion in a name, I think Isabella is really, really beautiful because, I don't know, I just love any name that ends with an A. I know, it, like, that's kind of weird, but I just think any name that ends with an A just sounds so pretty and it just, like, flows really nice. The third name is Willow, and that's an English name, and it's a nature name kind of because you know like the willow tree or something like that but it means graceful so i just think the name overall just sounds really elegant and it has such a really nice meaning the next name is an old english name um the derivation is actually um uncertain but it's blake i think it's such a pretty name um it's a guy and a girl name but i think it just sounds really pretty like blake lively or something like that i don't know it's such a pretty name the next name that I love is Kalani. It's actually a Hawaiian name and it means sky, but I think Kalani just rolls nice off the tongue and it just sounds like such a beautiful name. I don't know, I just feel like if your name's Kalani, then you're just going to be like beautiful. Another really beautiful name is L. It's simple and classic. It's an actual English uh, yeah, English name, and it means beautiful fairy, which I just think is like kind of really cool. Um, and really pretty, I guess, but L is just a nice, you know, uh, basic pretty name. A Hebrew name that is really pretty for a girl and a guy is Jordan. Uh, it means to flow down or descend, but also um, in the biblical times, you know, uh, people get baptized in the River Jordan, so it came from that as well. So Jordan, yeah, I think Jordan's really pretty, and I like to spell it with the Y. I just think that looks really nice and unique for a girl. A French name that is really pretty that means from Elder Tree Grove is Delaney, and I just think that name just sounds gorgeous. I don't know. All these names I keep calling cute, gorgeous, and beautiful and stuff, but I actually genuinely love all these names. But yeah, Delaney, I just think that sounds like a... To me, though, it sounds kind of Southern because I'm from the South originally, so it sounds very southern to me, but I don't know. I think it's really pretty. Another name that I love so much and I'm so surprised I didn't use is Brooklyn. Um, it is an English name as well and it means water or stream. So the meaning is very naturey as well. But I just think the name just sounds really, really beautiful. For And it's also another gender neutral name. So you'll know like guys are named Brooklyn, girls are named Brooklyn. But I think for a girl it just sounds really, really pretty. And the last name that I just think is beautiful is Vanessa. It's Greek and it means butterfly. And I just think that's a gorgeous name. And it just, I love the names with A at the end, like I said earlier. So yeah, I just love the name Vanessa. But that's the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you found names that you liked or you thought were pretty. Uh, personally, myself, I just like names from the way they sound and the way that they're spelled besides the fact of the meaning and stuff like that. Um, obviously, it's nice to have a really good meaning to the name, but I just really like it mainly based on the way that they sound and stuff like that. So yeah, thank you guys for watching.